All right, right before we start the video, I'm going to be adding this little clip right here in front of some of my videos, maybe every other, every three. I'm going to be covering 7 Deadly Sins Grand Cross on Global Drops. You guys already know what's up. This game was number one in Korea, number one in Japan. Bro, this is going to get a global release. Check out the website. Make sure you pre-register. I hope you guys are still with me when I cover this game. If you pre-register, you get a Meliodas outfit. You get the Dagger of the Pledge. You get a super rare Meliodas. We get a free multi and 100,000 gold. Of course, you can pre-register at any time. I don't want to put it in the description because YouTube's annoying. But all you got to do is go to this website, sdsgc.netmarble.com slash en. Once you're there, you got to put in your email. And then you click I agree. And then subscribe now. Bro, this game is the most... You know what? Let's just jump straight into the video. I don't even want to talk about it. Just beautiful. Okay, okay. You know what? My last video, you guys think I clickbaited you. Alright, you guys are like, yo, Adam, why did you clickbait us? This shit was ridiculous. I thought it was going to be about double. Guys, I said keep your eyes peeled. Come, take a look at this thumbnail right here, bro. You can clearly see my boy Gouldery in the back. Yeah, and he's even right here, right above Cryware. So, before you guys go crazy in sickle mode, alright, I did not... <laughs> I repeat, I did not clickbait. I said keep your eyes peeled. You know what I mean? Technically, I did click on devil, so <laughs> I'm gonna give myself some props on that. Yeah, I'm gonna give myself some Pepe claps. That was good. That was good. That was good, Adam. That was a good one. But see, that's what happens when you guys give me a day off. That one day I didn't upload, I made those two bangers, and I just went out the you know and the Gildery video. But uh, they're not gonna be as edited as that anymore because I got a schedule now to follow. So before we start, once again. Uh, I pop up my stats some of you guys most of you guys look actually aren't even subscribed to my channel only 15% are So if you guys want to hit that subscribe button that'll surely help me out hit a like uh, comment comment guys I respond to most comments around um, 90% and I heart all of them and I always try to get back to you guys of course now today <sighs> I just I, I remember something that I didn't remember earlier and it was the fact that how do I put this? If you're pulling for Spirit Drive, you know he's not guaranteed. And there's another unit in the banner. And that other unit is not necessarily bad. He's actually decent. It's Royal Knight Asta, I think that's his name. Royal Knight, or is it Royal Dweller? I think it's Royal Knight Asta. It's the one where uh, they're all chilling together and they all form a group to take down the Eye of Midnight Sun. Uh, spoilers if you haven't gone there, but I'm sure you're there. It's where they're all wearing their outfits. The one that teamed up with... Um, with Yuno against Leak, he just didn't go double form. But yeah, that's the one we're going to be talking about today. Uh, he's an okay unit overall. I'm just doing my dailies while talking about this. And not to get it mixed up, I'm going to show you the other two or three Asta's we have in the game right now. Because I think I do have them all. So, Royal Knight Asta compared to these ones. So we have um, this Asta right here, Demon Dweller. Everyone should have this Asta who is free. You go to unlock and you just go ahead and unlock him. Uh, Black Demon or Black Devil. Black Asta, I'm an idiot. Black Asta, of course, is Black Asta. He literally has resistances on everything. What a demon. Um, we have the 3-star Asta that everyone likes to use, but I have him at 6-star, I believe. Or is it 5-star? Ah, uh, here he is. He's at 6-star. He's actually not that bad. Uh, contrary to belief, like, his relic is pretty okay. But yeah, he's not that bad. Um, restore own HP, damage enemy, damage enemy, and then raise OU on participants' damage. Okay, he's not that bad, right? Pretty okay character. And then we have one more. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, there's no more in this one, right? We can go to lock and check. Oh, uh, yeah, we're good. So we have one more coming out, and it's going to be White Day Asta, which is going to come out on March with White Day Finral. Video will be out on those two, they're demons. And then right now, Royal Knight Asta. Now, Royal Knight Asta is going to be in the banner with, um, you know, just like this. We can go to summon tab right here. We see the Aust or the Yuno Langris. We can see the Mirio Leona and the Noel Utakata. Uh, the Devil Leak. It's going to be like this, except with Royal Knight Asta and Yuno. Now, let's go ahead and break them down. I'm going to go ahead and hop on Infinity Clover. Of course, link in the description, or not in the description, the comments, pinned comments before you guys ask, because I get a lot of questions. It's going to be in the pinned comment, all right? Here we go. We're on the website. Uh, shout out to Phoenix. The website creator, his YouTube, and the website will be in the comment. Let's go ahead and go to units. So units and roles. Uh, this oh, this teaches you everything. That's actually kind of sick. Whoa, whoa, that's kind of sick, dude. 
And when I use this website, you just go to here. I'm certain he's an attacker, or it could be no. Oh, that's a cool picture of uh, Asta. So yeah, there they are. They're both beside each other. They're both attackers. Now, Asta, Royal Knight. Let's go and check him out. Character stats. Okay, 4,000 HP. Really good for an attacker. Attack 900. That is absurd. That is really, really, really good attack for an attacker. Defense 300, which is pretty good for an attacker. Speed is 275. That's normal. And wisdom is a bit lower than average at 200. Luck is right regular at 250. Formation 1, Black Bulls. That alone should be like, okay, this unit's good. The fact that he's Black Bull formation is good enough for me. Same with uh, White Asta. Formation 2, Main Dog. I don't know if anyone even uses that. We can go and check that out later. But his Grimoire skill is uh, Double Beast Equipment. Let's go ahead and just... Uh, would it be in Global? No, he he's not on Global, right? So he'd be in Japan. And it was an equipment, so we're going to look, look at it. It's double beast equipment. I can break it down real quick. I should have opened this beforehand. I thought he uh, he gave a formation. I guess not. Uh, is it even on here? It should be on here, right? Double beast cage. Here it is. How to obtain five star real knights. Uh, it gives you 300 attack, 200 defense. Okay. Um, Not as nearly as good as Yuno's, but they're n they don't even fit in the same spot. So there's that. You could combo them nicely if you pull them both. If you're a new player, that'll help you. Now, his special, which is his arcane art, his first ability, an attack to all enemies in range. With this three dot right here, middle is going to be taking the most damage. Low chance to seal skills for a while. So basically, if you're using them in PvP, you're going to be able to seal. That's really good. Devil does that. Devil's a demon. Uh, he's also not the best unit on global, in my opinion. Uh, low chance to seal skills for a while. Once again, that's really good. Oh, this is skills. This isn't even formation. Never mind. Devil doesn't do that. Uh, this guy seals skills. Uh, that's really fucking good. Wow. Actually, guys, that's these right here. They're literally just going to be doing basic attack. Okay. Let's, let's move on. That's insane. All out magic. Greatly increase the damage done by AOM. Mm, I mean, if you just want the damage and you feel like your team has the crit from like Charmy or something, the New Year's Charmy and all that when she drops, you know, this would be kind of good. You just need the damage. You get the damage. Skill one. A powerful attack to enemies in range. With this formation right here. The middle one, and then it swipes off to the sides. Okay, this is a pretty good skill right here. Skill number two, for a long time, give self low chance at counter. So basically, you give yourself a buff, which gives you counter. So if they hit you, Asa's just going to get a free hit back. That's really good. That's just more turns. That's more DPS. Um, that's just more damage overall. Your character's damage is going to be higher. And it's, it's good if you... Because um, his defense is pretty okay, right? That's a bit... I don't know if that's a bit higher than average, but his defense and HP are pretty good. So if he gets hit, I mean, it's hell, man. He's going to do some free damage. But the damage is going to be greatly increased. So that damage with the counter is going to do insane damage compared to just him regular attacking. So it's even better, and it's a free hit. Free hits are free. Skill 3, a powerful attack to enemies within the range. And here it is right here, of course, middle, and it swipes off to the sides. That's really good. Now, is he any uh, you know? Of course, he's not any you know, right? We can go back to, you know, over here. He's not even close to, you know's level when it comes to skills or the relic, guys. <laughs> you know's insane. It attacked all enemies in range, slightly reduced enemy speed. For a long time, the more AOM participating members, the greater the attack boost. Attacks of, like, I already went over this guy. This guy's insane. He's not matchable. Like, he's really not. I love this unit. Uh, right now, you guys should be expecting, where are they? Units. Um, I think he's a jammer. He would be a jammer, right? No, but we're going to get the white day unit soon. Wow, they're not jammers. Uh, defenders. I know one of them's a defender, Asta. So we're going to get white day Asta. And then when it comes to enhancers, I don't think you know. Or no, Fenrir would be an enhancer. But I guess not, huh? He's no? Yeah, here he is. So we're going to get white day Fenrir and white day Asta. I'm going to break these two down. Save right now. Fenrir is broken for tower. He will save you the game. Please save all your jewels. For him and you know, we don't know what's coming out tomorrow night, but I'm going to make a video on it. So if you guys enjoyed, hit that like button, subscribe, and peace out guys. Thanks for all the support. Uh, that I'm sorry about that Ghoul Duty video, but I mean, it was, I think it was pretty lit. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, see you guys. Have a good one.